welcome back to my channel. So today I have a little mini get ready with me of my everyday makeup, but not just my everyday makeup. It's using all drugstore products and also I'm excited because this is a collaboration with the sweet and beautiful Colleen Diaz, also known as XXO Lenny here on YouTube. She's going to be doing the exact same thing, a get ready with me of her everyday makeup. So definitely go check her out. You guys are going to love her channel and her videos and everything. So basically this is my everyday makeup. I can't say that I wear it every day because obviously I do tutorials for you guys but um, every other day that I just feel like you know just wearing some makeup that's super easy and fast to do this is kind of like the makeup that I've been going towards and I've been using it in some of my videos and I mean I've been posting a, a few photos here and there I thought I would show you guys what I do it's not every single time using the exact same products but it's basically you know using similar products here and there you guys are gonna see how I do it so yeah if you guys want to know what I do to do my everyday makeup then just keep on watching the very first thing I'm going to do is fill in my brows because that's the first thing I always do. So for that I'm going to be using the Maybelline Brow Define and Fill Duo which is in the color Soft Brown. I never really fill in the inner part of my brow anymore because I just feel like it looks more natural if you just leave it like the way it is. But then after that I just blend it out. And then no matter what I always take any concealer and then just clean up on the bottom of my brow. I never do the top because again I just like them to be a little more natural looking. <laughs> I don't know why, but this always makes a huge difference on my brows. <laughs> And then once I have my brows done, I move on to my eyes just in case I have fallout. I clean it up and then, you know, I apply my foundation. So I like to always uh, go ahead and start with my eyes after that. So first I'm going to use a primer. So the primer I'll be using today is this one from Prestige. It's called Primed and Ready Eye Primer. So after I've primed them, I like to add a transition color or just something in my crease to, you know, make my eyes look more defined. And yeah, so basically I like to take a light brown shade, but today I'll be using this bronzer, the one that I'm going to be using later on for my face. And this one is from Essence. And I'm going to take this little blending brush and just blend it into my crease. Then after that, I like to take a very light shade. Um, it could be like a beige colored one, like a bronzy one or whatever. Just something that looks very natural, I would say, but with a little bit of shimmer. I always like it to have a little bit of shimmer in it. I just, I just feel like it makes the eyes pop a little bit more. So I'm going to use this palette from Makeup Revolution. And I'm going to take the lightest shade over here and apply this all over my entire lid. And then take your blending brush again and then just blend out your crease again. And then next I'm going to go ahead and take a matte shade. So I'm going to be using this one and applying it underneath my brow bone. And then basically we are done with that eyeshadows. That's how simple it's been for me right now. So I actually really enjoy it because it's super, super fast. But now I'm going to take my mascara and apply a few coats of this to my lashes to prepare them for the falsies. So then for my lashes, since I don't do a wing liner, I like to use some really, like really, really dramatic 
well not that dramatic but at least some really fluffy voluminous uh, lashes so I really have been loving these from Vegas Nay these are the Eiler Grand Glamour lashes and they're very very you know full as you guys can see but they're not super super long they're just really nice and fluffy so I definitely recommend these and they're very very affordable Then after you have your lashes on, I'm going to go ahead and just connect the lash band to my inner corner of my eye just so I could get rid of that little blank gap right there. So just take any black eyeliner. The one I'm using today is from MUA Makeup Academy and it's in the color black. Alright, then moving on to my face, I'm going to use a primer just to kind of like smooth out my whole entire face. That way it just looks like flawless, you know? So for that, I'm going to use the L'Oreal Miracle Blur uh, Instant Skin Smoother and this is the oil-free one. And I'm just going to apply it with my fingers. And then for my foundation, I'll be using this one by CoverGirl in the color 842. So then after that, I'm going to apply my concealer and this is the one I'll be using. This one is from Maybelline and it's in the color Fair. Bringing it all the way up here just gives me like a facelift so that's why I like doing that. And then to set everything, I'll be using my Rimmel Stay Matte Press Powder. Now taking my Essence Bronzer, I'm going to go ahead and bronze up my whole face with this. Now I normally don't like to apply so much uh, blush or anything, sometimes I might skip it, sometimes I just might add you know, something almost close to the bronzer color and just apply it a little bit right on top of it. So for that I'll be using this uh, blush from Makeup Revolution which is in the color Nude. And then of course we cannot forget about the highlights so I'll be using this one by L'Oreal which is in the color Golden. And of course, don't forget to add a little bit of mascara to your bottom lashes. I normally don't ever apply any eyeshadow. I kind of just been loving the way it just looks without any, you know, eyeshadow underneath there. So just apply a few coats of mascara to your bottom lashes. You know what? I almost forgot. I also pop a little bit of the highlight into my inner corners just to make it look like you know, pop even more. <laughs> now for the lips, I love using a very, very nude, nude like lipstick. So first what I'm going to do is line my lips with this uh, lip pencil by CoverGirl, which is in the color Smoky Intense. And then for my lipstick, I'll be using this one by Wet n Wild. This is one of my absolute favorite ones, um, but this one is called Bear It All. It's like super, super nude, and I just love the way it looks. So definitely recommend this one. 
All right, so that is it. That's all I do for my everyday makeup. Basically, I've been really, really loving it. It's super quick. I know right now, maybe in the tutorial, it might seem like it takes more time because I was explaining and everything, but usually it's like 15 minutes and I'm out the door. So yeah, I really hope you guys liked it. And if you did, don't forget to give me a huge, huge thumbs up. And also make sure to subscribe if you haven't subscribed to my channel. And don't forget to go check out my friend, Colleen. You guys are gonna love her personality and everything. So yeah, with that, my loves, thank you guys so much for watching as always i love you guys so so much and i'll see you guys all in my next video bye Mwah.